Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Start with the name of Almighty Allah, who is most merciful, beneficent. Today we are going to learn network scheduling and network scheduling. Our topics we will cover in this presentation project management what is the project management we will define it then we will go to network scheduling first we introduce network scheduling then we will we will detail discuss about network analysis then we go to network what is network basically then we will go we will go to project network then we will discuss the basic network analysis methods then we will discuss PERTR CPM techniques which are mostly used in network analysis then we will be discuss the terms used in a network then we will be discuss rules of network construction then we will go to network samples First of all, what is project management? Project management is the discipline. Project management is the discipline of initiating, planning, executing, controlling, and closing the work of a team to achieve a specific goal and meet a specific success criteria. In project management, first to start a project, we should to initiate the project. In this we form the team, um, approve the budget. Then we will we go to going go for plan. In plan we plan the all project. Then we go for executing the plan. In this we execute all our planning in real world. Means to complete different tasks to monitor the progress of different activities then we go for project close project management it is an art of controlling the cost time manpower and hardware hardware and software resources involved in the project completion of a project on time within budget without comprising quality network scheduling in today's globalized marketplace to stay ahead of all means facing tremendous pressure time is crucial time is money an excellent but delayed project means cost our bonds in this scenario proper scheduling of the project is even more of a concern than ever before in managing the project network analysis network analysis refers to a number of techniques for the planning and controlling of complex project its primary aim is to program and monitor the progress of a project so that the project is completed in the minimum time it pinpoints the part of the project which are crucial what is network a network is a graphical diagram consisting of a certain arrangement of arrows and nodes for showing the logic logical sequence of various tasks to be performed to achieve a project objective what is project network a project network can be described as a set of activities are the schedule of all the activities required to complete the aim and goal of the project in specified time basic network analysis method there are five methods which are utilized for network analysis one cpm critical path method two ccm critical chain method three pert method program evolution and review technique fourth gert method 
graphical evolution and review technique fifth mpa method the metra potential method pert or cpm techniques the two most frequently used form of network planning are cpm and pert cpm critical path method pert method program evolution and review technique the initial step in PERT and CPM is the determination of all the specific activities that cover the project and their relationship. Example If we are going to for activity A obtain the budget approval for this we had spent two weeks for this no immediate procedure is required. When we go for activity B obtain the machine this can take five days five weeks for this activity a should be done when we go for activity c hire the operator for this one week duration is required for this also activity a should be completed when we go for activity d install the machine for this one week of duration is required also for this activity B means obtain the machine is required to complete it now activity E train the operator it's required six weeks it requires six weeks for this C means higher the operator should be completed now and the, at the end F activity produce the good for this we have one week and for this D and E should be completed activity D is what install the machine and activity E is train the operator terms used in a network activity and effort that is required to complete a part of the project it is represented by arrow note it represents the beginning or completion of an activity it is represented by node each defined activity is represented by one and only one arrow in the network before an activity can be undertaken all activity proceeding it must be completed the arrows showing various activities are telling of logical procedure only. The length and the behavior of the arrow are of no significance. Events are identified by numbers. The activities are identified by the numbers of their starting and ending event events or by alphabets. A network should have only one initial and terminal node. Network symbol. Arrow shows the activity where nodes show the event. In sec in third para, in third row, you see that two, three nodes and two arrows are sequentially arranged. Where node one is initiating and node third is completed but the two arrows show that activity A must be completed before activity B completed the fourth row of the table has four nodes and three arrows where two nodes are initial and two arrows are going to a one, no one node and then one arrow is going to another node. Here activity A and B can occur currently but both must be completed before activity C can begin. Now there is three arrows and four nodes. Activity A and B must be completed before activity C and D can begin but C can be can begin independent to D and vice versa. Thank you for your 
thank you for your art thank you for your parent thank you for your thank you for your watching please subscribe our channel